guys and welcome back to my channel in today's video we'll be unboxing all tags so these are things which we have been using for a long time or we don't use anymore and i decided to unbox them for you guys and show you what i have found in my house so like and subscribe and without further ado, let's get into the video the first thing which i'm gonna show you is this wrist blood pressure monitor so everybody know what a blood pressure is how it works so typically this is for your wrists this is what it looks like i don't know if it has batteries inside it has one battery out should i find it in the box and yeah Usually you put it right here, but this is for your wrist, so you put it right here. It's a Velcro mechanism. I don't know how. I've never used this, by the way. By the way, so yeah. So in here you need batteries, but I have only one, so technically. And like that, you press. You have the mem, the start when you press it, and it shows here everything you need to know about your blood pressure. It's very cool because it's handy and actually it's not, um, how to say, I feel it a bit comfortable and putting it right here. It's very cool and it actually measures correctly because we have checked this blood pressure monitor and one which you put right here and they're showing the same results. So this one is working and I think it's pretty cool and handy. The next couple of things are related because they are cameras and the first one which I'm going to show you is this one, it's XL1, your reliable partner. So this is a very old camera because people don't use this anymore, it comes in a case. I think we have bought this case, so here it is. We used this a lot when we were traveling because modern cameras weren't a thing back in the day, so this is the camera. It, this is what it looks like here you can see yourself you're in this so it's a very very old one and this is how the magic happens we have a lot of these things so yeah it's like a whole movie you're watching with this i don't know why this feels very cool old-fashioned so now probably these cameras my words nothing or worth a lot more because they are very old and you can't find them anymore but yeah smile well i don't know if it's working actually i have to check because i think i just shot a picture which is interesting i didn't tell this was working though so we're gonna open it and see. i don't know how can i see if there's a picture in here or not well Let's pretend that I took a picture with this thing because it's super old, but maybe it is working, so smile! Yeah, it's a very cool thing, I remember it, so yeah, very handy. So the next camera which I'm gonna show you is this Olympus camera, this is what it looks like on the box. Originally I planned to use this camera for vlogs and just filming, but when I saw the quality I was like, no way I'm gonna use this, my phone has a better camera, and it's a phone. It's an old camera, but it's in very good condition. So many of which nobody reads. And here it is. The camera and the charger and all the things which we have inside. So here it is, the camera. It comes with a handy. We bought this case because we want to keep our camera. This is it. It's a very beautiful camera on the inside. It looks brand new because we keep our things. But it's old and the quality of this thing is not very good. Probably... Yeah, it's not working because it needs to be charged. Here is where we put the battery, the SD card and the battery. So when it's charged, here is the card and the battery is right here. So this is the battery which you have to put in this little device right here. So let me check how the battery works. So, so yeah, it... The battery plugs here and you use this cable to plug it in and then charge it into, into the electric system. So this is how it works. We need a couple of hours, I think one, two hours to charge completely. But yeah, this is the camera. It's a very 
cool camera though it has a lot of features as you can see right here but the quality is not the best so i have been checking pictures which we have inside and i can retake the same with my phone and they will look better but it's not for the camera now well, okay that's it it's just a very beautiful picture which you won't be able to see but yeah it's a very cool camera it's just the quality that stopped me using it the last camera which i'm gonna show you is this pc camera it's a digital product this is by driverless high speed usb 2.2 dvd draws quality yeah it's an old camera compared to the cameras which we use now but back in the days it was a pretty dope camera this is what it looks like let me take it out of these things so this is the camera it's for your computer i'm pretty sure you can use it on your laptop as well so this is a, it's kind of cute though if you ask me this has a clip so basically it's adjustable to your computer this is the cable it has a lot more cables on the inside so we have this gigantic cable here which i believe is to plug it into your system but what the heck is this plug we don't have these type of plugs here so i can use it. this is a plug which we can use it from my laptop and this is a plug like compare like i can use this one i don't know why it's inside and this is another cable i won't open it but it's like a pinkish cable as you can see here and we have something i guess this is for the camera i don't know if you can see this okay it's not very visible so i'm gonna open it it's like this thing right here i don't know for what is it honestly caution but precaution for high electric sensitive devices and that's for it's a kid camera though look at it but i have never used it so i don't know what the quality of this thing will be my laptop has a camera i don't use a pc for now and i don't need this thing but it's very cute it looks new so it's rarely used but yeah it's a cute camera and i believe that it's uh, fully functional so the last thing which I'm going to show is this TP-Link wireless and USB adapter. As you can see right here, it's compatible with Windows 7, so you can see how old this thing is. Honestly, I don't know why we have bought it, because I haven't seen any of us using it. I haven't personally. But yeah, we have this thing, so this is what it looks like. Well, first some papers, of course, they always do that. So what is this? Yeah, installation guide we have here. This is well as purchasing guides i guess they have other devices as well they have a lot of devices wow okay this is purchasing guide another one with more devices here you get to see the guarantee card yes another quick installation guide and this is what the tech looks like so it's this little device it's like a flash drive honestly this it's like a flash drive. It's 150 megapixels. It's not much, but for the time when we bought it, that was a lot of megapixels. So yeah, this is QSS. It says here again. This button, if you press it, I don't know if you can see. There is a button right here, but I have no idea what it's doing because I haven't used this thing honestly because I don't need it. Okay, I don't need this device. It comes with a cable. What else? We have. Uh, I guess it's the installation disk. What else do we have? Here we have written something, old passwords, but we have changed them, so technically they're not valid anymore. We have motherboards. I don't know what this is. We have some other CDs. These are other installation disks. This is instructions manual. This is for Philips monitor. I'm pretty sure this doesn't belong here. And we have another cake in case you need it so most of these cds are not for the device but we still use them so here it is a closer look of what the device looks like it's very handy again like a usb drive but i don't know if anyone uses these anymore but well it's a good device we used it for a while probably but well nobody uses these things anymore so yeah it was cool for the time but now well things have changed Okay guys, you see their video, hope you enjoyed, comment down below which one was your favorite tech, if I have to choose, 
probably will be the Olympus camera because it looks like the newest tech of all that I have showed you but because of the quality it's also very old so yeah this is all the tech that I can find at home we are not a tech family so we don't have much things but we have used every single one of them some of them very little some of them a lot especially when we were traveling we used cameras all the time to take pictures not of ourselves but of everything what we see so we can show it to our friends and family so yeah that's for today i hope you enjoyed this video like and subscribe and i'll see you next time bye guys